you're all doing well. If you're new here because you enjoy your room tour videos, then hi, I'm Lottie. And this is the right video for you because I'm going to be doing a room slash flat tour. I wasn't quite sure what to call this video because I live in a studio flat, so in a one room flat. But then again, it's my entire home, so it should probably be flat tour. Yeah. Welcome to my flat tour. So, as you might know, I moved in here into my little flat about three kilometers from the city center of Helsinki um, about a year ago. And it's also the first flat that I ever decorated myself. So before this, I only lived in student flats. I sublet rooms. And yeah, this is the first place that I have my own furniture in. And it was a big project for me. As you might know, I love design, so I also love interior design. I'm a big fan of Instagram, everything aesthetic. And I really wanted this flat to resemble me in a way and also reflect my values. So I first kind of thought about what these values should be. And I realized I really appreciate everything that's finished, so finished design. Um, I also always try to be as environmentally friendly as I can, so I really wanted local products. I wanted second-hand products, because one, money, two, environment. And, 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 and natural stuff, so natural materials. And this is my flat, this is what it looks like, and I'm gonna tell you the best stories to the best pieces of furniture and just show you around and show you the details because I'm very proud and I love it very much. So let's start here. When you come in, you got a big mirror and another big wardrobe. And, okay, I'm gonna show you now. This is the view. Ta-da! I live on the sixth floor, so, got quite a nice view that back there is the sea actually but you can't really see it right now because of the trees this is my little kitchen this is one of my kitchen centerpieces I always wanted a mocha master coffee machine these are actually Dutch but literally every Finnish family and every company in Finland has these it's a coffee machine that's really easy to use. I actually use it for tea as well. Um, I don't drink that much coffee and I just love that it's rose gold. There's another rose gold centerpiece in here, which is this lamp. Oh, I love it very much. You can see my reflection. Hi. So these two pieces were bought new, but then we come to this. I got the table and the chairs off a second-hand Facebook group for 40 euros in total, and I kind of repainted them because they looked old, but I really like the old design and how the colors match, as well as the linen um, curtains, which I got used. Ooh, here we have one of my two favorite pieces, which are these drawer chests. They are teak, they are from the 60s, and they are actually my grandpa's. Um, my grandpa has an upstairs floor that he literally doesn't use, and these were standing there, and I asked him if I could have them. And being my kind grandpa, he said, yes, he doesn't need them, so take them. So I polished them, and then later I googled antique um, furniture shops here in Finland, and turns out these exact drawer chests are sold for about a thousand euros here, because they are vintage. So that's quite cool. Okay, now we come to what's probably the centerpiece of my flat. To go with my teak furniture, I purchased this teak um, shelf. And it's actually something I'd been dreaming of for very, very, very long. Because as you might know, I've been collecting Mimi mugs since I was very little. In fact, we got this as a souvenir when we lived in Germany and I was about maybe six years old. And I've been collecting them ever since because for me, they are part of my... Finnish heritage. So if you don't know these characters, they are Moomins. They are based on Finnish books by Dove Jansson and there's also a cartoon and they are what Finnish children grow up with, I'd say. You watch these cartoons, but then growing up I also read the books and they're actually really deep and you learn a lot about life and 
Ah, oh, they're just really, really, really good. And I'd say most Finnish families, if not all Finnish families, have at least one or two Mimi mugs at home. Um, this is Finnish Design, this company. And they were produced since the beginning of the 90s and there's um, one seasonal mug for every summer and every winter. These are summer mugs here. These are winter mugs. And then there are the character mugs, which are these. And they bring out new ones every eight years or so. And those replace the old character mugs then, and they actually grow in value. I think the most valuable mugs I have would be, oh, these two from the 90s, and then these two, which were like celebratory mugs. And these here were only sold for one day in total. Oh, I love them. And I love how they're displayed, and I love, oh, I just love picking a Moomin mug every single morning, depending on my mood, and my favorite bit about this flat. Moving on to my next favorite bit would be this leather couch. I think the couch is from the 60s as well and I actually did a very 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 long search until I found it. I remember I moved in here and I was like I need a couch so I went to Ikea I bought one and literally like two days later I was like why the heck did I do this? Why did I go to Ikea? I don't like the fact that the entire world can purchase the exact same couch. There's no culture, no personality about it. And the quality is really bad, which is bad for the environment. So I actually had it picked up and it was returned. Um, and then I lived without a couch for quite long and went through lots of Facebook groups, online thrift shops and so on until I found this and as I said it's from the 60s and there was an elderly couple that was selling it and I think it would be worth a lot because it's made in Finland, it's real leather, it's vintage as well and I actually paid 165 euros which is incredible and I love it, I adore it and it's so good because it's I think over two meters in length so it's actually good for sleeping as well, you can take these big cushions off and uh, sleep on it. So that's where my guests sleep. These little cushions are all from my grandma. This is Finnish design, Marimekko. And this one is my favorite. I'm not sure if my grandma made it, but I hope she did. I love it. Oh, speaking of my grandma, these little details, like this salt stone and that one, and actually these baskets that my plants are in. I found at my grandparents' place. So these are things that my grandma used to buy. Oh, and this, oh, this throw. I got this throw from my lovely, lovely, lovely friend, Anna, who made it for me. She made it, she knitted it, because she knew I didn't have one. Oh, I love it. That's what I have naps underneath. Mm -hmm. The shelves on my wall, as well as the big frames, are second hand as well paid like three euros for them in total. And that um, candlestick I found at my grandpa's place and it's finished design and I love it. Oh, this one, as well as my little coffee table, are uh, made in Finland too and actually they're made by blind people. So Finnish design and a good cause. Got my musical theatre books in here the Wicked Grimmery, and I've got some Helsinki themed books, let me show you, um, for my guests. These are by the publishing house called Dream Cozy and they are absolutely stunning. These are different houses all around Helsinki. This is about people here. And I've got way more of their books and especially their cookbooks up there. You should check them out. They are wonderful. And last but not least, we come to my bed, which is a loft bed. I think that's what you call it, which I adore. I've always wanted one. Ah, I'm gonna miss it so much because I'm moving soon. But yeah, when, whenever I go up there, it feels so cozy and secure. I like to call it my bird's nest because I go up there and then I look down and it's my own little world by itself. Oh, I love it. But I also really like what I've done underneath. 
this swing my grandpa and I built together. Here we go, it's very simple. I've always wanted a swing in my room and I thought this was the perfect opportunity. I like to sit here and talk on the phone or when my friends come to visit, they really like to sit here and chat. And then I've got this little cozy corner in here, which, oh, it's so nice. Look at how soft it is. Yeah, um, these are actually new. I ordered them from Amazon. It took me quite a while to find these. I'm quite happy with them though. Oh, and then we've got this desk, which was a completely different color. It was like light blue, I believe. Um, as well as this chair that was black. I found these at my grandpa's place as well. They were ugly. Now they look really nice and suit my flat and the size is perfect. Here we go. Oh, I almost forgot to mention the rugs. These rugs are all made by my grandma. My grandma used to make rugs and you've no idea how happy it makes me that I have her rugs in here. She just meant so much to me. She was my favorite person ever. My grandpa's, the, the grandpa you know, um, his wife. And yeah, she made these. And I know I always have a little part of her with me. And I know that she'd be very, very happy that I'm using her rugs. Mm. <sighs> so I think that was all. Do I still have something to show you? No, not really. The lamp. More rose gold details. Tell me what your favorite thing about my flat is. I don't know if it's the swing, if it's that little corner, if it's the couch, if it's my collection of Mimi mugs put up on a wall, which is so nice because I used to have them all in a cupboard and you can see them, so that's so much nicer. Or if it's these amazing vintage um, drawer chests. Mm. I love it. Yeah, I love this flat very much and it actually breaks my heart that I'll be moving out very soon. I've got like one and a half months left. Hmm. Yeah, it's sad. It's my first ever own little home and it just looks so much like me and I love it so much. But what can you do? I'm gonna go off to live my dream and live in a nine square meter room with four housemates. Oh well. Um, if you know anyone in Helsinki that needs a perfect room, let me know. This is absolutely perfect. I love it. And I think I'll come back to you soon. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.